Greetings everyone, this is Community Manager Hellgear speaking. YouTuber Hellgear will be here momentarily, but before he comes in, there's a particular issue that I would like to take the time to address. So please, I would love it if you, the viewers, could, could say your opinions in the comments section below. Alright, Brass Tax here. Often in the community, I am asked either by a fan of the game, or a fan who is also a player of the game, how did you get X character? Oh, I love X character. How do I put him, him or her in my game? Only to tell said fellow player, well, this character was during a promotional deal and that deal is no longer going on. And <laughs> boy, are they kind of bummed out. Some of them even heartbroken. Now, the Snoopy's Town Tell development team has, on multiple occasions, given players the ability and the chance to win Patty and Rerun. So this brings up the question of the video. Other than Patty and Rerun, which promotional characters would you like to see available again for you to obtain? Let me know in the comments section below. As well as let the Snoopy's Town Tale development team know about this on their Facebook page. One more time, which of the promotional characters would you like to see available for you to obtain? Please share your thoughts in the comment section below. And with that being said, I'm going to turn things over to YouTuber Hellgear. You guys have a nice day. Oi, right, YouTubers, it is I, Hellgear. Welcome back to Snoopy's Town Tale. So, a uh, couple things have happened since last. And I know this is a little bit later on in the week, but, you know, it's that time of the year. So, first and foremost, got to level 53. Second, I missed out on the second of the mini Thanksgiving events. And I'm currently going to do this one. Water Tower. Alrighty. To address one more issue, and that was figuring out the sawmill. The crafting stations in the game, you know, the main ones, they all have names. And the first one, which I just tapped on, is called the Sawmill. That's right. We have names for our crafting stations now. Which, <laughs> I'm just now starting to understand. We're going to craft some more of these. And some more of these. And the last Thanksgiving dinner I'm going to need for the Thanksgiving missions here. So, Lila still has something else to do. Oh, I have to get another food rations. Ah, uh, Snoopy, where are you, dude? Okay, that's a nine hour wait. Mmm. All right. Wait it out, my man. I didn't collect all that rent, but I'll get to it. Opened up this area of real estate here. So, that's the big, the big wonderful deal here. And this area of real estate, I still need <laughs> a lot of the beagle bucks to open up, but I have the items for it. I'm still trying to work on this area of real estate, which I almost have enough money to expand onto. And... I put another grocery store over here to get more milk. Speaking of which, Charlie Brown, you should be free now. Only to get some more milk. Because again, one of the items that you need is a strawberry dessert for the water tower. So, let's get Charlie Brown back in the store. And then we'll go to the other store and have Lila collect her milk 
I think I might have to boot this up. Okay, so. Let's start collecting some rent, everyone. Because again, got to get another Thanksgiving dinner. Alrighty then. Grab some strawberries because we're going to need this. How many more of those strawberry desserts am I going to need? Two more. Alright. You, there will always be a need for the Brussels sprouts, apparently. And the cranberry sauce. So, let's zoom this out a little bit more for you guys. And start collecting all the various things that we need. There we go. I could have Schroeder do some uh, picnic time with Lucy to get a strawberry, but I want him to actually get some more Brussels sprouts, man, because uh, I'm going to need them more. Okay. So, let's talk about that question of the video. Don't worry, I'm okay, you guys. The three most common characters I'm asked about, YouTuber Hellgear is asked about, are, you know, other, other than Patty and Rerun, are Lila, Mimi, and Peggy Jean. So, many times I have to tell other players, well, these characters, if promotional periods, are done. Uh, my white trophy statue isn't isn't loading in here. There we go. Very nice. I have 11 clown toys, so I can part with one. I cannot part with my sweet potatoes, though. The, the, those, those, unfortunately, I cannot part with. There's a gift box. Some more of that good, good loot. There's another gift box. Patty, you can help me get that one wreath, so dance for an hour. Dance. It's interesting that her dancing isn't the same dance that she does during the end credits of uh, the Peanuts movie. How astute my observations are when it comes to certain characters. Hmm, another beagle buck. Good. Good, good, good. Uh, I do need strawberries, but I have to get the space going. So let's just grab them. I should have enough cranberries for 
cranberry sauce. You know, it's funny. You know, the Hell family had their Thanksgiving, and one of the things that, you know, one of the things that wasn't added to our Thanksgiving meal was cranberry sauce. And I'll be real with you guys. Cranberry sauce, <laughs> cranberry sauce sucks. Let, let, let's, let's be perfectly clear. Cranberry sauce sucks. No matter how much you want to slice it, that's the one part of your Thanksgiving. Actually, let me take that back. That's the one part of your holiday meals nobody wants. And if there are people that do want it, it's one of those things that nobody wants too much of. You know, I can always do without cranberry sauce. I can barely tolerate cranberry juice. But we drink cranberry juice because it's good for cleaning out your bladder and the impurities that could stiffen and, well, not stiffen, but accrue in your bladder. Thank you everyone for your rent. Oh, that feels nice. This is going to be a grindy. This is going to be real grindy. And once I'm done making all these Thanksgiving dinners, I can just stack up um, roasted Brussels sprouts, miniature cabbage. Cabbage should be is best consumed at full size, even if it is sliced up for coleslaw, fish tacos, whatever. For full size. I could click on Polly and see what's up with her, but we're not doing Town Tale Circus. We're doing Thanksgiving right now. I'm just glad I don't have to go through too much pumpkin pie. I'm going to recycle those and then let's see what's up because we've got another 16 seconds before this offer comes in. By the way, I just want to thank you guys again for watching this series and everything. Oh, if I can finally sell that. Goodbye. Thank you guys for tuning in every day to the series. I, or, well, every week to the series. Because I appreciate that. You know, I may never say it enough. And I still tell myself that I don't say it enough. I don't thank you guys enough for tuning in every week to watch this simulation. On the building and development of, of the town here. So, what should happen moving forward? Well, obviously it's December now. The year has come to a close. And hopefully this is like the last of the Thanksgiving events. Because the Christmas event is going to be coming up. Or at least it should be coming up. Maybe it'll be up after this wonderful sale. And who managed to get this sale right here? I'll be honest with you. It's nice to see these sales not be $10. But, um... This really isn't my take. For one, I don't need the gardening shack. I already have it. I could use another Brussels sprouts farm, but... The two that I have for my farm area is, is ugh. a pumpkin wagon to get pumpkin bread. I may or may not need that. The 280 vehicle bucks would have been nice though. But the old watermill and the forklift, you know, I just don't have places for that. 
I don't have places for those. Hopefully I can get some more real estate. I can put up this water tower that I'm working on. You know. I'm really hoping. And, and, I, and I seriously mean this. I'm really hoping that when the next update shows up. We'll get some more of this wait for future updates real estate to open up. Especially chapter 7. I don't know how they're going to do chapter 7. But either way, it's going to have to deal with the item you get from completing chapter 6. That's going to be a constant. But it would be nice to get some more space, some more of this wait for future update space open so when Christmas time and the 2018 Christmas tale comes along, everybody's going to have some space to put their Christmas decorations down. Especially if you're like me and you have a lot of your Christmas decorations stuck in storage. I don't have too many Christmas decorations currently out on the map. Some peppermint topiaries here and there, like that one right here by the summer camp and the orange juice truck. I'll just zoom in on it. That one, here's a lamp, which should not, holiday street lamp, which this needs to be placed somewhere else. You know what, I'll put it right there. There we go. I didn't mean to pick up those groceries, so let's turn that around. Let's turn that around. There we go. They recently did a contest where you show off your town doing the Thanksgiving stuff. And I just want to say congratulations to all who won. I didn't enter. But um, hopefully as time goes on, we'll get more. Maybe in the Christmas update stuff. I might enter that one because I have a lot of Christmas stuff. You know, the peppermint topiaries are nice. Um, hmm. I should put up a lot of these stores that I have no more use for. Like these staple stores, I should put that stuff up. See, there's another street lamp right here. And this Christmas diner got that right there I'm gonna leave that there because it's nice to see a diner like that and then over by chapter 2 is where I have a lot of Christmas themed stuff more white weeping willows this pink winter house this peppermint bridge that's all Christmas stuff you know um The hot cocoa factory, that's actually a Christmas themed item. But I keep it near the root beer so it's like something else to drink. That sort of thing. And then just to show you guys because, you know, it's the storage. I got all this other stuff that I had to move. See, I earned the grain silo. I have the grain silo, it's just I have nowhere to put it. It's supposed to go on the farm, but I really don't have the space to put it anywhere on the farm. You know, I still have the school gym from the science, from the back to school event with the science fair. I don't know where I'm going to put this. Somewhere in the school, I don't know. You know, the small lake, which was the um, scene from the summer event with Peggy Jean. I have all this stuff. You know, I had to move this water tower just to get a few things into the farm. See, I got the Christmas house from last year's um, from last year's Christmas event, and I'm gonna put that back down too. This harvest corner, I need to just put somewhere. 
I think I'm going to put it over by the Thanksgiving table. See, more peppermint topiaries and street lamps, the Christmas factories, the toy store, the tree, frozen pond. See, the old windmill, that I had that by my farm. Candy cane stand, see, th these sort of things, I just have them in storage. Normally, I would sell them, but... You keep them around because you might just need these again. I can sell these. Give it all that. That. I need my Brussels sprouts. I will give you a, a cup of cocoa though. Do you think they should add another character? Thank you, Charlie Brown and Snoopy, for your rent. Do you think they should add another character for the for the Christmas tales? If so, who would you like to see? Thank you, Schroeder, for your rent. Wait, this is Schroeder's house, right? Yes, it is. Ah. I guess the only characters now that I'm looking forward to are the rest of Snoopy's dog family mainly because of the family portrait item that you can get in the game but other than them I really don't know who else to really add to the game you know we've added Frida's cat Farron we're probably not going to add World War II which is the other cat you know Three and four, you might add them because they're uh, five's younger twin sisters. You know, it's going to be interesting to see who else gets added to Snoopy's Town Tale as the, the years go on. Hopefully, there will be more space. So, uh, development team, just between player hell gear and you guys, please, come next update. More space. More, more of this way for future update space. Just have all this, have at least two of these plots of land opened up. And you got, like, what? five of these areas of land could we get two of them opened up in the next update for christmas tales that way that way players can have room to actually put their christmas stuff down and have a christmas section in their town and maybe like snow that that that's what this is one of those things that was mentioned in the town tale survey about decorations let me just go to decorations really quick you know we have sand sidewalk like this right we should have like a snowy sidewalk thing which kind of sucks because uh not having the snow or like water puddles like that so we can make a makeshift ocean kind of blows because this sandy area right here is supposed to be like a beach for me or a desert or something like that but it's fine it's plenty of sand. We got a sand castle. We got the sand for Farron's house. We got the Sphinx from last year's Halloween. Which, that gauze is kind of worthless. I'm actually proudest of my little safari here. I had to really work on it afterwards just to get it really going. But I'm glad about that. If you guys have enjoyed yourselves, remember to show your love, hit the like button. Remember to please answer the question of the video. And as always, thank you for every like and favorite, comment, and share, and subscribe to the channel.
We'll be back on Town Tale Tuesday for the next installment, so be sure to subscribe and turn on those mobile notes. So when it's time to build our town, you'll be ready to go alongside myself. You can have two more of those, and I appreciate you guys being here every step of the way. But for now, I take my goose from the oven because I'm done. Bye-bye, everybody. Bye-bye.